Hello and welcome to this expert blog on plotting dip and strike readings in ArcGIS. Firstly, I'll bring in my XY location from Excel. This is the spreadsheet I wrote up detailing the dip, strike and location measurements from field observation. I have designated which columns contain the XY locations and I am now defining which coordinate reference system the data needs to be projected in. In this case, the data is in a UTM grid, 30 north, and is using the European datum of 1950. These correctly plotted points need to be made a permanent as data imported from tables are only available within that particular map document so I have exported to a shapefile to make this data a more readily available GIS file type. The new shapefile is brought into the map document as a new layer. Now these points have a default symbology so it would be nice to have a, a correct symbol applied. To do this we will navigate to the layer properties and search for the appropriate symbol type. A quick search for dip brings up a simple dip strike symbol. These look nice but they have no rotation applied. So looking at our measurements from the field I have a dip and strike column in the attribute table. We can use some advanced symbology to rotate the symbols according to the attribute table data. Be careful when doing this to use the correct rotation type. With an underlying geology map and labels for the dip data, we've successfully plotted dip and strike readings in ArcGIS.